Welcome to another pixelforlife.com video tutorial. My name is Shannon and today we're going to learn how to do some acne re removal. Uh, there's several new tools in Photoshop 6 that uh, allow us to do pretty much the exact same thing and um, we're going to kind of go over a couple of them. Uh, this isn't really super difficult to do. Um, it's kind of more of a simple lesson but I thought it was something cool to try. So uh, we're going to go ahead and zoom in here and you can see here that there's definitely some acne issues on this uh, photo and we want to clean them all up. Now first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and make a duplicate of this layer so that I have an original and then a completed one um, so that you can see the difference uh, when it's done. Now first thing we have is the spot healing brush tool and the, the key to this one is to go ahead and make sure that the size is a pretty good size um, around the area. Now the reason you want it to do that is because your hardness is going to be set down to about 45 percent or so and by having the bigger uh, circle around the acne spot, it will actually will allow it to um, work better. And all you have to do is click once, and there you go. It's gone. And you can see here you also have um, some issues here where it's like little bits of, of acne. And you can actually just kind of paint that area in there. And sometimes you get a good result, and sometimes you won't. It just kind of depends, so just be kind of mindful of that. And you can see that that got kind of messed up, but we can go ahead and fill that in there with the skin tone again and undo that last one. And kind of like that, just kind of smooth the skin areas out a little bit. Kind of like that. And we'll go ahead and zoom out. And also, just an FYI, you can now hold down the Alt key and zoom in or out at the same time, um, or just click the regular zoom tool and do that, which is actually a really nice feature. So, uh, we'll go ahead and go up to here. So, that area there looks pretty good. And that is the Spot Heal Brush tool. Now, now we have the Healing Brush tool, and what this actually allows you to do, it works the exact same way. You're going to want to make it a little bit bigger than the acne. But what's cool about this, and also put that hardness down to about 45% again, but what's cool about this tool is you actually get to select the area you want to take from. Now, for instance, this area down here on the chin where we did this, it might have actually been better to go ahead and click. Um, and I'm getting this other part of the tool by hitting the Alt key. And by clicking here, and then I can simply paint in, kind of like that. Um, but for, for this specific purpose, I'm going to go ahead and just select this area here and then I can click there and you can see here that spot is gone same thing I'm going to click here and just kind of get rid of some of these spots on this girl's forehead and just kind of even it out a little bit now the thing about acne is that um, you will probably never get it perfect um, because if you did then the image would just look fake um, but what you want to try to accomplish is you just want to kind of get some of the basic area blocked out as best you can um, and then when you zoom out, you won't really see um, a whole lot of problems with the detail. So I'm going to go ahead and work on a couple of these spots and kind of like that. That actually looks pretty good. And I'm moving this picture around by holding down the space bar, just an FYI. Yeah, get rid of that spot, come over here, work on that spot and that spot, maybe that one too. And there we go. And that looks pretty good. So now we have just these uh, couple areas left. We have the cheeks over here and then a little bit on the nose, but I probably won't worry about the nose because I can tell some of those are freckles and let's be honest, freckles just rock our world. And with that, we'll go ahead and conclude this lesson. It's looking pretty good. So we'll go ahead and zoom out here and you can see here that it's pretty cleaned up. All we have left is just that one little spot there. And we can just use the healing brush tool again on that. And then right here on this one. And then we'll go ahead and zoom out. You can see there, it looks great. So I hope you guys enjoyed this lesson, and we hope to see you again soon. Thanks, guys.